my besties welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by and watching we're gonna do a little timu haul today uh, maybe about a half hour long so i hope you stick with me through all of it we're gonna check out these items see if they're a good bargain for what i paid for them and um i do have some notes <laughs> that i took about timu circle but of course i forgot them at work. So I will do a video on Timu Circle very, very, very soon. Um, I am a Timu Circle member and I think it's worth it, but I want to tell you a little bit more about that. Um, this is, video is not sponsored. Uh, so I just say, let's just get right into it. That's just my thing. I like to go straight for the gusto. So let's just see what I got, see if the prices are worthy and, uh, Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what we think. Okay, so first item, I got these. Um, they were $6.29. You get a package of 16 of these, okay? So I got these for like cords and all kinds of things, but this is what they look like. They are like, they're, they're like magnets kind of, so you can use them for all kinds of different things, like anything you would use maybe, you know, to, oh, there's a whole bunch. See, this is what just one of them looks like. So maybe you want to wrap these around like some cords or something. I mean, they aren't super strong, but if you just need to like kind of keep some cords in place, you know, you get a whole bunch of them. Um, I'm not sure what else you would do with these. What would you guys, what else would you do with these? What would you do with them? So you get all of these, um, all 16s for $6.29, but that's what I was thinking was to like keep my cords together on my computer and stuff, but... Yeah, I'm not sure. But anyways, they were $6.29. I thought they'd come in handy. So we'll see. We'll see what we figure out what to do with those. Okay, this was $2.69. Um, it's hairline powder, but I really don't ever use this stuff on my hairline. I usually use it on, like, my eyebrows instead. Because you guys, um, I did a get ready, get ready with me video, and I did my stamper on my eyebrows so yeah this is this color is light brown now you of course you could use this on your hair um you can use this on wigs if you want to put a root on a wig which i will show you that someday um but yeah this is what it looks like and there's a very um expensive brand where these are like 19 bucks um and it's really popular and i can't remember exactly what it's called but this is literally the same thing but i got this one in light brown if you open the bottom it comes with this little poof like this and then you just open up the top and that is the color light brown which actually it's like really light let me like that's the color light brown um but yeah I actually use these more as a eyebrow powder than a hairline powder but like I said let's say you have a a blonde wig that you need a little bit of a root to or Maybe you just, your hair's growing out and you need to root it, then just take this and like stamp it at the top. I, I don't really like a non-rooted wig. I think they look more natural when they're rooted, but I mean, I don't know. That's just, that's just personal opinion. But for that to be like under three bucks and this stuff is usually like, you know, $9.99 on, or $19.99, up to $19.99 on, on Amazon, then I'd say that's a pretty good deal and it's a nice color. So yeah, I'm, I'm liking that. Um, this was $2.54, more electronic type of stuff. I love getting all kinds of, like, electronic stuff off of Timu, like phone cords and USB things and all of that. So this is a folding extension socket. So it looks like this. Um, and the other side looks like this. So you plug it into your wall right here. You pull this out. And this can go any way you want it to. So this moves all the way around. And then you have like a plug on the side, a plug on this side, and then two USB ports. So that way, if you plug it into your wall like this, it's very slim and there's not a lot of like cords like sticking straight out. So it'll like, you know, I, 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 all of my outlets seem to be like behind a couch. So when I plug something straight into the outlet, it like sticks out this much. If you use one of these, then you can plug it in on the sides or on the bottom and it won't like stick straight out. So if that makes sense. So $2.54, let, we'll see if it uh, works or not. <laughs> I'm sure it works, but will it set my house on fire? That's the real question. <laughs> That's the real question. So $2.54 for that. We'll try it out. We'll see, we'll see if we burn the house down. Okay, this was $3.48. It says color number 
01, so it must be makeup or something. Oh, I know, this is that, um, this is that blurring balm. I, I've seen Hey Everybody get these and also um, fav favorites with Laura, but I've seen them get the blue colored one. And this one's like a pink colored, so I don't know what the difference is, but it's like a matte blurring balm. Um, let me take it out of this package if I can get it out. Oh, good. It comes with a little poof, too. So let's try this while we're while we're sitting here. Let me get my glasses off. Put my mirror. Uh, oh, see, so I'm actually really kind of shiny right there. So this is a perfect time. But this is what it looks like. It's not a very big product, um, but it, yeah, it says matte primer, poreless. Uh, smooth skin. Long wear. So looks like this comes with this little poof we're gonna try it because i am like i just want to see if it takes away my i'm looking a little glowy right through here but my my foundation is usually pretty glowy anyways but let's just test this out so it comes with this little puff here it is we're just gonna let me feel this oh you can barely feel it i don't know anyway i put a little bit on there and then we're just gonna go in and press down and yeah it does it takes the shine right away so that's awesome. Oh, yeah. Love. It's definitely blurring, too. Can you tell that it's, like, blurring all my, all my things? I love it when my things get blurred. Yeah, I like this. I like this. This would be great to keep in your purse, too. Like, get one for your purse because... For that price, $348, I've, I've used some blurring, like Mally, Mally Cosmetics has something like this I used to use, but it was way more expensive, way more expensive than $348, so yeah, highly recommend that, I like that right off the bat. Okay, this is I think another one of those wall things, I don't know, maybe not, let's see, it's $1.69, it looks like one, now it came in kind of its own package, uh, made in China, this one's a pink one though. Let's see here. Okay, so yeah, this move. This this move. Yeah, barely, but it does. But you yes, you, you stick this in your wall socket, and then on each side there's a plug, and then on the bottom there's a plug. So this one just has outlet plugs on it. It doesn't have any USB ports. So I don't know, but we'll see. We'll see if they burn the house down. Um, but yeah, for a dollar sixty nine, I kind of like because it makes everything flat like behind your couches and stuff i don't know am i making sense here so a dollar 69 so let's hope that that they work <laughs> okay this was 239 it says one pack of 30 cards i think i bought these as like thank you cards maybe let me see let me take a look so are these actual cards or no okay so they aren't they're more like postcards Here's what they look like. So they're not like card cards. They're just postcards. These would be great for journaling. I think I thought that they were like actual cards. Um, but that's okay. I mean, they can be used as actual cards. Oh, look how cool this one is. It's got like mushrooms on it. I love that. Like they're very nature related. Here's one with, uh, I think I have this upside down. Do I? Don't I? I don't know. Anyway. Very, very nature related. Here's another mushroom one. These are really cute. Gigi would love these. Gigi would, I might just send these to her. How adorable. Look, here's one with like some butterflies. These are really pretty. I love this one. It's got like notes. Really pretty. If you're into butterflies, definitely get this pack. If you're into nature, but it, they'd be nice as postcards. Like I could write thank you notes and then put them in an envelope, right? Like I could just, the backs are just, plain so if you want to use them as cards i mean they're really pretty so you get a whole bunch whoops i almost dropped them you get 30 and they all look different i mean they all look different i don't even see one that's the same so maybe but i mean there's 30 here so look how pretty that is i love these but yeah i think i thought that they were like full cards but that's okay i mean you can still you know write friend mail notes on the back i like writing personal notes i'm like big on uh, you know, mailing personal items and writing personal notes. Like, I just feel like it's kind of old school, but I love to do that. Like, I love a handwritten note. There's something about a handwritten note, you know? So, yeah, those were $239 and you get $30. So, that's not bad. 
Okay, this was another makeup item. <laughs> um, it's concealer and highlight like palette. It was five twenty four. Uh, it's a cream product, I believe. But how pretty is that? It's like really nice packaging. Really nice packaging. It's by Carla Secret. 524, if I didn't mention that. It opens up. Let's hope nothing falls out. There we go. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, a couple of those look a little shimmery, um, which that's not a bad thing, but maybe you could use like these four are definitely shimmery, like highlight. Um, these could be blushes. I mean, they're okay. Let me, let me try them out a little bit here. That's not a bad color for foundation. It's very light. There's, this is like a banana color. So if you need, I mean, they're really kind of oily though. Mm, I just don't know. Like I'm not really getting like a huge color payoff, but like, this is like the light one. I mean, it's not horrible. It's not horrible. Let me, let me swatch one of these shimmery ones it's barely like oh that's really pretty though right here that is really pretty like if you're gonna use that as a cream highlighter yes i really like that i mean they're not bad they're not bad i i just don't know like this is a very orangey color up here so i'm not sure what i would do with that let me get a makeup wipe so i don't know i mean they're very kind of oily though i'm afraid that if i did like my whole face with this that i'd be an oily mess but hey i got that mattifying balm so there's that but i really like the case on this very travel friendly if you go somewhere and you just could you could use like this as a whole face which you could if this matches your skin tone or you could mix a couple shades this would be a good like highlighter um these two would probably be pretty good foundation shades. You've got some highlighter, a couple blushes. Might not be too bad. You'd probably just have to carry a bronzer with you. But yeah, it's not bad. So if you needed another color, you know, you could always... Maybe there's other colors that would be more for, like, my skin tone. I don't know. I just picked that one. It was probably the lightest one, to be honest with you. I'm a fair girl. I, I get sunburned so easily in the summer. It's ridiculous. I haven't even been out in the sun, to be quite honest with you. Like, it scares me sometimes. Okay, anyway... These are a pair of earrings, and wow, look at these. <laughs> look at those suckers. $349, wow. Do I have earrings in? I do. These are Timu earrings, by the way. I really like those. Um, this is from Shein, this white thing, and this, this tank top's from Stitch Fix, which I don't get a lot of Stitch Fix. It's, like, really expensive, so anyway, back to the earrings. So these are, like, an acrylic, very light. They've got a little bit of blue and then this super duper duper hot pink. Wow. They match my glasses. Yeah, really nice. I like those. They're very, you know, they're very sturdy, but they're very light. So that's good. But I like the turquoise with the pink. Love that. Very eye-catching. So, I mean, for a $349, though, I mean, I don't know. You can probably get, like, cheaper earrings on Timu, but $349, that's not bad. Okay, a couple pairs of nails, or do you call them pairs or sets? I guess it's a set, right? So here's some of these false nails. They were only 68 cents. Only 68 cents for those. They're really pretty. They're like uh, lilac and pink and white. I don't even know if you can see them. The package is really kind of tore up, but that's what they look like. Um, really pretty. The pink is nice and sparkly. Well, actually, you know what? That's probably more purple than pink, I guess, huh? It just looks pink next to the other ones, but, but now that I look at it, it's probably more like a purpley pink, like a lavender, maybe? I don't know. They're really pretty. 68 cents. Can't beat that, right? For like a manicure? Heck yeah. All of my nails come from Timu. I actually used the glue tabs for these today, so we'll see how long they last, but these are also Timu nails. But yeah, 68 cents. That's a bargain. That's a straight bargain. Okay, this set was $1.98. They are also kind of purpley, but kind of gray. And they are not my usual... Uh, well, actually, they're kind of black even, maybe. I guess they're more like black and gray. They are glittery cat eye. But they're like a... These aren't stiletto. I guess they're like almond, maybe. But yeah, they're really pretty. And cat eye, really pretty, like those. So a buck ninety eight for you know to put your nails on, and they always come with these, um, you know, the glue tabs. And like I said, I use them this time just because I've been doing a lot of stuff outside, and I don't like to like glue on nails because 
I like to kind of be able to take them off if I'm like out in the plants messing around and I end up with dirt everywhere. So, but yeah, dollar ninety eight for those. Really like those. They're very pretty. Okay, let's go here next. Okay, dollar forty eight for this. It's a hair clip. It's silver. It's a silver heart. It's really pretty. I bought a couple of these um, in different colors, but I really think they're pretty and they're really good quality. Very good quality and they hold quite a bit of hair. So yeah. I really like them. Very pretty. $1.48 for that. Okay, um, this is another set of face makeup similar to the one I used in my Get Ready With Me. Um, this color, it doesn't say what color it is, but it's a three-piece set. It was $6.29. You get like a contour, a highlighter, and a foundation, I think. But, you know, the foundation shade I can never seem to match. Yeah, blush and bronzer, highlight. They all say that, so I don't know. Oh, this one says Quartz Rose on the bottom. This one, I have to open them, I think. Let me cut them. Quartz Rose. See, that's the thing I don't like about these nails with the just the glue tabs. I can literally feel them, like, <laughs> falling off as I pull stuff off. This says Espresso, so that must be the contour. And this one says Pearlescent something so it's not a foundation it's just a contour a contour a highlight and a blush which i feel like i maybe have this set but they're really nice packages but yeah i like these like cream products i, I pretty much only use cream products so they're really hard to not be good to be quite honest with you um normally i use saint makeup and i am a saint artist but you know, I like to dabble in a little bit of everything every now and then. So, okay, this is Espresso. It's going to be your contour shade. It comes with this little plastic cover. There's that color. And then this is the Pearl Essence something. Can't read that, but whatever. And it's like a gold, kind of like, it's got, looks like it's got like a little bit of a gold tint to it. Really pretty though. And then this is the Rose Quartz. And the Rose Quartz has a little bit of a shimmer to it as well. But really pretty. Like, you can use these on your lips, your cheeks, your eyes, anything. So I like using these sets. So $6.29 for those three pieces. All you would need is a foundation, and there's the that's your whole kit. <laughs> and a lippy. So, hey, look what we have here. A lippy. $2.24. This says um, Butter Lip Cream. So let's test this out. Butter Lip Cream in the color, does it say number three? Looks like this, or like this, however, it's good to hold it. Butter Lip Cream, oh, and it's like, oh, it's sealed too, so it's a package within a package within a package, so. Okay, Butter Lip Cream. These kind of remind me of like the NYX Butter Glosses. There's a smell. I don't know what, but there is a smell. So we'll see if this like gets sticky. Make sure I don't have it in my face. It's not sticky right off the bat. It feels kind of it feels very moisturizing. So let's see if it like dries down. It says it's matte. Ultra matte. So I let's see if this thing dries down really sticky or hard. Let's let's see. We'll test we're testing it out. Okay, so I got two of these. Um one for each of my mom's dogs because they love this lamb chop thing. So six thirty six for both of these. I'm gonna give these to my mom tomorrow because I'm gonna see her tomorrow. So I will give her these little dog toy. It's a little lamb chop. They will love these. Her dogs love it, and it's got a squeaky in there. So I'll give her those tomorrow. <laughs> How cute are those? Six. 36 or whatever I said. Okay. What is this, Jen? 453. I think these are for ice cubes. Like, if you want ice, like, shaped ice cubes. Okay. I'm pretty sure these are for ice cubes, but let me open one of them. Or maybe just bake in these. I don't know. Are they ice cubes? They must be for ice cubes because it dips in here and then the mold is like, you know, it would just be this round. So. I assume these are for ice cubes. 
so then you can put them like down in your drink or whatnot i love putting like big ice cubes like this in like the big stanley cup so those are really cool 453 for both of those okay next are these they are placemats you get four pieces they are the american flag don't know if i like these um they're okay i mean i just don't think they're i just don't think that they're printed very well they're not terrible, but they just don't look like they're printed very well. Do you know what I'm saying? So I'm not real sure about these. Um, for $5? Mm, I don't know. They're very, very thin. Like, really thin. I can see my ring light through them. I, and I don't really like the print. They... <sighs> I don't know about these guys. I don't. I. I'm. I would. I would say off the bat, I don't recommend these just because of the, the way the print. I don't know how if it if it's coming out okay on the screen. I can tell you that in person, it looks very like printed and not very vibrant. I guess, but maybe it's supposed to look that way. I don't know. I might have to put them on my table and see. But I just mm, they're not. They're not. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. That's just my honest. That's just my honest first impression, which is what this is about, like a first impression. Like, I just don't know. I would probably not buy those again, and I would not recommend them. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, this was, what is, it? oh, it's a big, like, um, Swiffer thing. 663, you get a long-handled duster and 20 pieces of the dust cloth. So, you get the big, long duster. Here it is. It's two pieces. You can put it together. I mean, you can use it as a short handle, too, um, if you wanted, you know. Like, it, you, I mean, you could just literally use it as a short handle duster. Or you put these two together like that, and then this extends so you can... Is that all the farther? Oh, no, it's it keeps going. It's going and going and going. So that's how long it is. It's pretty long, honestly. Pretty long. And then you just the buttons and it folds back into each other here's this one so it folds back and then you get 20 of these now these probably you could probably buy swiffers with if you would rather have the original brand i like to shake these out and then fluff them because there's nothing on this side <laughs> I mean, there there doesn't really need to be if you're dusting, like, I mean, you can use, like, one side, you know? I like, the Swiffer's usually on both sides, right? I feel like. I don't know why I can't pull this all the way down. There it goes. So that's what it looks like on. I'm dusting you. No. But, um, I mean, we'll see how it works. I like the extending pole. Um, and for six, how much was this? Six sixty-three. <laughs> The cats are down here playing if you hear them. Um, I just this is the this is the part I'm concerned with is being good. The pole thing's nice because you can extend it and lock it and all that, but this these I would probably just either buy from Dollar Tree um, or something like that. That's what I would do. That's just my two cents. But it folds down, you can put it in your cupboard or whatnot. But yeah. I mean you get 20 of them, but I can see stuff flying everywhere. Like when I opened that thing, it was like it was like little particles of that blue stuff went everywhere, so that's kind of what I'm trying to clean up, you know what I mean? I don't know. Anyway, okay, um, let's see what the, okay, these last two items were free. So, I'm assuming that in this order, I probably got one of those deals where it was like, spend $40, get two free items, which I always fall for that all the time so whenever that pops up on my screen i do it and the reason okay so let me explain this just real quick when that happens usually what happens is you have to pick from their own list which sometimes it's things from your cart but if it isn't eh, you know i can probably find 40 dollars worth of stuff but if you're thinking to yourself i don't know these prices seem a little exaggerated which sometimes they are like they want you to buy up to 40 dollars worth to get two free gifts and you're like oh no these prices are kind of high so i would always like be like nah i'm not gonna buy that stuff because the prices seem higher to get you to buy stuff but with that being said i figured out 
that even though they're higher, once you place the order and you get your two free items, go in and do a price adjustment because the price adjustment is going to make it match what the actual price is. And normally I get five or six bucks back anyways. So spend 40, get two free items, go do price adjustments, and it lowers your, your order down anyways. So keep that in mind if that deal pops up. You might be like, oh, these prices seem a little bit elevated because that's what I did. I was like, I don't know. This seems like some kind of scam. But don't, go do the price adjustments like right after you order and you'll see that it will still let you. It'll bring all those prices down. Anywho, enough, enough of me blabbing. So I got this for free. It just says big on it. I think this is a candle maybe. I don't know. Please, God, let it not be a tumbler because I have 50 gazillion bajillion tum tumblers. Okay, it just says big on it. That's the only, and it's in this styrofoam, which we absolutely hate. We absolutely hate. Okay, it is a bit. It is a big candle. Look at that. It looks so rustic. It looks like a tree log. Now this is solar, and I believe that this comes in a small and a large. And I think that I might have bought the small one because I'm gonna do a couple or like a for our cat that passed away. I have like a thing outside I want to do for him. But yeah, it is solar powered. So you take this thing off right here. How cool is this? It looks like a log. Look at that. How cool is that? So I don't know if there's a battery or not in here. Oh, look, at, it is lighting up. You probably can't see it. See it flickering? How cool is that? It like flickers. I know and my lights are on. Hold on. Let me see if I can turn this, this light off at least. See how it like flickers? Look, oh my gosh, I love this. I love this. It looks just like a tree. <laughs> that is really cool. So yeah, I got this for free, but I know that you can buy these on the website or on the Timu site because I saw it and I saw a small one. They have like big and small and this is the big sized and it's got styrofoam all over. But how cool is that? I absolutely love it. If you love rustic stuff, yeah, totally love that well well worth whatever i believe i can't remember what their actual cost is but yeah very well made very well made really cute and the light flickers and look at the look at the like flame how cool is that it looks real that is awesome okay so this was free too it says two pieces of glass seasoning bottles oh i think i know what this is i think this is a salt and pepper shaker and i'm like heck yeah i'm getting that for free yeah as soon as i saw it i was like yes sir wait till you see these you guys they're huge but i got them for free so there's that okay they remind me kind of of like pioneer woman so here's the pepper one it's like a blue glass they're both blue glass and then here's the salt one how cute are these how adorable like oh my gosh they're glass really really nice glass pieces with silver lids. Love them. Um, there's a number two and number three on the bottom. I don't know what that means, but how cute are these? I love them. They almost remind me of like an antique, but you know, obviously they're not, but how cute. But you don't have to put salt and pepper in these. You can put like seasonings for your grill, you know, and put stick a label on it. But I mean, they're glass. They're really pretty. I'd actually, I like these. You know what else? If you don't want to use them as salt and pepper shakers, I would just leave the lid off and put like some water and like a couple of flower stems like out of your garden or something how cute would that be just as like a little vase adorable absolutely adorable yeah i love these and i got them for free what say what yeah so anytime you see those deals you know kind of check them out um i always do if if i i don't know how i get those deals like they don't pop up all the time they'll pop up pretty randomly but every time i they're like oh yeah Spend $40, get two free items. I always do it. I always do it. I mean, because you get some pretty decent deals, you know, for free. I mean, these, I don't know what they were regularly, but I, and this candle, I know I've seen on there and it's probably like 20 bucks or close to it. So, I mean, I probably got $30 worth of stuff for free, you know, so just pay attention to the deals and, um, yeah. So that is my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please consider subscribing and like my video because that helps me out in the algorithm um and i really appreciate that thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye